right, could you, could you state your name for me? Uh, I am Seth Slaughter. Okay, and you were in the you were in the National Guard, right? I was in the National Guard. Okay, well, um, what year did you go in? 2000. And how old were you? I was 17. 17, when you went in? I was deployed when I was 18. Okay, did you go into boot camp when you were 17? Yes. Okay, all right. And you got out? I got out a couple of months ago. A couple months ago. Okay, all right. Did you have fun? In oh, I loved it, man. It was, it was great. I heard it all. That's good. Yeah. Um, what what rank did you get out of as? I was the first sergeant. First sergeant? Yeah. Okay, so a gun, gunny sergeant, basically? Basically. Okay. Um, that's what, and I believe, if I'm not mistaken, that's the E5. Right? E5? Around there, yeah. Okay. Um, let's see. Did you ever get a... Um, I believe it's called a DD-214. What is that? Um, it's like the uh, separation papers. Yeah. Uh, I don't, I never got those. You never got it? Okay. Um, all right, let's see. Hey, what was your MOS? MOS? Um, uh, it's kind of hard because... I forget everything. I just. Uh, know, that was. I'm not really, is that, not really good memory, man. Uh, is that due to, like, deployments, or just yeah, in general? Just in general. Oh, okay. Um, uh, I don't remember. Okay, okay. Um, and you said that you were infantry, right? Yeah, I was infantry. Yeah. Okay. The uh, what? What'd you carry? Did you were like you were a heavy machiner, or did you just carry a standard rifle? Standard. What, what's a standard gun? It's an M14. M14? Okay, cool, cool. Um, do, you, do you have a military ID? Or do you know your number? Is home? I don't Is know. Home? Number. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Alright, um, have you ever heard of uh, Stolen Valor? Stolen Valor. Yeah, I've heard of it. Okay, it's where, it's where people claim to be prior service or veterans when they're really not. Yeah. Okay. So, I just caught you, man. I just caught you. So I want you to go ahead and own up. I want you to say it, because you're recording, man. Because everyone knows that what MOS is, okay? That's your job, that would be infantry. Everyone knows that. And you, you cannot go to basic training while you're 17. You have to wait till you're 18. You can enlist at 17. I ain't going to basic training Yeah. I just got you, man. It's on camera. I asked you that specific question. You know, illegal, right? No, yeah, it is illegal. Yeah, then why'd you do it? Wait, what's illegal? Record me. Oh no, dude, you know about it. You're looking right at the no. camera. You know what else is legal and what's a felony? Pretend to be a government official. Stolen valor, man. No, that's that's illegal. No. And you know that DD two fourteen I was talking about? Every single person gets that, and you would have got that just two months ago when you said you got out separation papers shows when you got in when you got out what rank you were an e5 not a first sergeant man and there's no way you got first sergeant in four years not to mention national guard is three or six year contracts not four because it's a dick move man if you're gonna be a bullshitter do it right at least and don't bullshit about being a veteran because that's some shit and if we were not here Dude, you'd be on the ground right now. I tell you that much. I don't know about that. No, yeah, I do. I do. So, go ahead and apologize. You not going to? No. Why? Because you're actually a veteran. Dude, I don't have to prove what, what I am to you. No, I'm not. I'm not asking you to prove it. I mean, that would be nice, but I mean, no, anyone, nice any, all. any formal, former military they carry their ID on them they do you don't just leave it at home for two days straight now because I asked you before why would I just carry it around it's like a driver's license man you carry that shit around I okay well I just got you man welcome to YouTube well, welcome to Facebook I don't give a fuck yeah man obviously you know brothers and sisters die for that shit they die for that shit and you gotta sit there and bullshit about it. Am I right? They're gonna sit there and bullshit about it. Do what? What do you say, man? 
That's what I thought. The improper way to be wearing a uniform. Got your beret on with the flash, no unit crest, no nothing on it. Your French Fortisse is all jacked up. Uniform's all wrinkly. Well, you don't need to take pictures of me, just go away from me. I'm not taking pictures, I'm taking a video. This is going on stolen valor. You know it's a federal crime, right? Yeah, it is. But I ain't doing this for, uh, to prove that I'm in the army, so. What are you doing it for? You got a VA card? Man, get me off video. Hold on, check it out. I want to see if you got one of these. See it right there? Department of Veteran Affairs, U.S. Veteran, Alpha Battery, 4320 Field Artillery, 4th Brigade Combat Team, 101st Airborne Division. That's my uniform you're disrespecting. Happy, happy Thanksgiving. Hey, sir. Can you give me your name? I know, but you never told me your name. I know, but I'm not supposed to tell them. It's, we're not supposed to get names on a high alert right now. I'm sorry. I have a question for you. No, seriously, I have a question for you. What? How does it feel to be a stolen fucking valor? What's that? You're wearing a goddamn uniform that our men and women don't even wear anymore. No, no, do you realize... No, my boyfriend and my friends have sacrificed their goddamn lives. I've done two civilian missions, ma'am. I've done two combat missions from after operate after Desert Storm and from 9599 and Operation Transfer Alpha Czar. So oh, you, okay. And then then why are you wearing that because, uniform? Because they told us the uniforms that we, the guys that got reassigned and called back, or they wear the uniforms that they left out of. That's it. We were never issued. I had honorable discharge. You know, that is complete bullshit. You want to no. know how I know? My boyfriend was in the fucking army. My well, best was, friends are infantry well, and the fucking well, Marines. Well, no, was, you're yes. a fucking liar well, and you're in stolen valor. And guess what? Next no. time I see you, I'm calling the goddamn police because you can get arrested oh, for wearing that goddamn it. uniform that my friends have worn and have I died have, for. I sacrificed my wife to tell you. I did four years in Marine Corps. Oh, did you? Yes. Then how come you're wearing that? Because that's what I had when I got out. I ain't having new issues. for 9599. Thank you very much. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I then you've been much. reassigned? Yes. No, they would have given you a new goddamn uniform. No, they haven't. Not yet. Not the guys who just got called uh, from being out of a long time. A buddy of mine's friend, 55 years old, just got called back. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yes. sure. I believe you. Yeah. Well, I have You're not a, even supposed to be wearing a hoodie excuse, under that. You excuse, do realize excuse, that, excuse right? I have, a, I have my military records at my house. Bullshit. You're not even supposed to be wearing a hoodie under that. Check this out. I did four years in the service. Third battalion, 26 Marine. Dog tag number 6830415173434. Thank you very much. Mm hmm. Yeah. Bullshit. 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 Yeah, well, I, Next time I see you around here, I will be calling the police for a stolen fucking ballot. You better I've fucking earned, watch yourself. I've, won, I've earned this. This is my shit from when I was in. Oh, the, but then if you were reassigned, they would have given you a brand no, new uniform. Not, not on, no. Now when you get a phone call telling you that you are being called back due to... What you do realize they won't even call you back because there's plenty of men and women no, no, who serve right now. You're, you've never been in the military in your life. You're claiming that you are. You're all over the paper. You've got a flat. You've got a flat. You're a disgrace. So, so close after Remembrance Day as well. You need to be exposed for what you are. If you want to beg, beg. But don't pretend to be in the military. You've been in the paper. Thank you. You're a disgrace. I feel Thank sorry you. for your dog. Hey, and also, mate, you always, always twat that dog as well. There we go. The lads know. Everyone knows, mate. I used to live up there, and I seen you twat Why don't you? Why don't you have a bit of dignity and go home, Mike? Because I can't go. He's home. real servicemen who really I struggle, and you, home. you just, you, you just claim to be ex forces. You're a disgrace. I People have actually served. You don't see them begging the street. You're not ex forces at all. You're all over the internet. You're all over yeah, the paper. I You're a fraud. You're a disgrace. I'm gonna have to go now because I'm getting quite angry.
Okay, so let, let's finish a little conversation from up there, if you don't mind. Can we do that? You said you was in the military? Was it, what, 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 what branch you serve in? Marine Corps. Marine Corps? How many years? 24 years. When did you went in? When I was 18, I was back in 1984 or 83. Where did you went for your basic? Los Angeles. For the Marine Corps? Okay, and what was your MOS again? What? What was your MOS? I flew through planes, helicopters, drove tanks. So you took, you, is it right that you say you did everything? Yeah. So what was your discharge rank? I retired. Okay, and so. I, and I was a colonel. You was a colonel. You know I'm fixing to do, right? Yeah, I just want to say to you, you are fake. You're full of shit. No. Where's your discharge papers at? Where's your, where's your military ID at? They're locked in a safe at home. Okay. There is it... I, I know that you're lying. No, I'm not. Okay. Well, here's the thing. I know you are. You are... It is called sending people to Bailu. You know what that is, right? You are taking people's credit for being in the armed forces. That is a felony crime. You understand me? You was never you was never in the military. How do you know? There's no way you can do every single thing in the military. I have to pick up the sack of others. Uh, nah. I served eight years of straight ROTC for the Marine Corps. I have brothers that I serve in an ROTC has died for the Marine Corps. You are fucking fake. You want to start something? No. I'm telling you, you're fake. You want to start something? See, you're on recording. You're a fake. And I'll make sure I press charges for what you are doing. You don't have no proof. Recording. You're a fake. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. Hey, you just want to start trouble. No. Yeah. You're on, you are a fake. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. The next time you see me, let me see your paperwork and I, will, I apologize over it. Okay? But in my book, you're fake. No. Yeah. Yeah. So all you, you want to do is start a fight for you. What the hell are you doing? No, I just know you're fake. I spent eight years in straight ROTC. I have brothers that died for the Marine Corps. Are Literally. You, do you want me to get this goddamn cop here? I don't give a shit what you do. Because I'm not doing nothing wrong. At all. You're picking a fight, motherfucker. No, I'm not. Yeah, you are. No, I'm not. I have, I have plenty of witnesses that say otherwise. You are a fake. You don't even know me, man. I don't care. I dealt people. I have dealt with people more than you. I have dealt with same exact people like you before. No. You're a fake. Yeah, you gotta get off my back. Like I said, you're a fake. Get off my back. I'm not on your back. You came up on me. No. Hey, you asked me. You said, when is the bus getting here? I did not. Yeah, you did. No, I did not. You're lying. No, I have other people that would testify I did not. You said, where's the damn bus? No, I did not. Yeah, you did. Was I talking to you or was I talking to my, bro my brother? Not you. I don't talk to fake. No, I, I, I was next to have to come over here and tell Whatever. you. Whatever. You, you, are, you are fake. And this would be on recording on YouTube. Okay? You know you're breaking the law right now. For what? What no, right it's called one party consent. Get it right. No. Yes. No, 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 I'm not my consent. No, one party consent. Ohio's one party consent. Got that? You're a fake. Point blank. Now you want to start something? Like I say, you are a fake. You want to start something? You're a fake. You want to start something? Like I say, you're a fake. Okay? Well, come on. Come Dude. on.
Look guys, just because you call, he got called out, he wants to act like he's big and tough now. <laughs> this is what you get when you are acting like you're a fake military professional when you're not. Okay, well, I'm gonna get the cops if you don't get off my back. Go ahead, do it. Do it, please do it. Because I'll be- I'm asking you guys to back off me, man. I was here before you, bro. No. Hey! Sun trees! Come here! Uh, why don't you just leave me alone? I was here before you. Hey, you, you, you said you, when is the dude, damn bus? Get out of my fucking face. You, you said you, you. Get out of my face. I'm not even. I'm not even you in are in my face. face. You're coming up on me. Being hostile. No, I'm not. Can you stay right here so I can have a witness, please? Because he's coming up on me being no. hostile. He slammed his post down and when I was trying oh, to leave. Oh, crap. I, I shut the stuff down. You Bullshit. Know. Dude, Dude, have a seat. Down. You are fake. Your best bet is go someplace else. Hey, you, you have when is the damn buses getting now, here? Did I ever say that? Mm. Did I say when is the damn buses getting here? Yeah, I, I came here and You are fake. I came here to tell you. I don't care. Basically, you're a fake. The buses come no. no, you're you're a fake. You don't know that. Leave. You can go somewhere now, dude. Get dismissed. No, you're, I you're I am to back off. Listen, I'm telling I'm not you. I'm the one brought this up. I, I'm he, telling you. Know, I was you, next up to tell him when when the buses did here. I'm telling not, you. Well, we don't need your help, so. Back I'm off. telling you. Well, you, you and I'm giving. Back you, off me. No, I'm telling you. I'm giving you a field warning right now. If you do not back off of me, I will be forced no. for self-defense in the state of Ohio. As soon as I am forced to do self-defense, it will be your responsibility. No. And I can you, call. You, you would be lying. No. Yeah. Everything would be on recording. And by law? You're, you're, you're a fake. No, you, you don't know that. Yeah, I do. You, you, you don't even know me. You don't even know what I did. Let's go somewhere. People like him ain't worth our time. Well, you better back off. Hey, this is going to be on YouTube. By the end of tonight. Kenton's Fakeness is going to be the title of it, okay? You know that's a, that's a crime that you just did. Opposing a government official when you're not. Let's go over there under How the you know? Yeah, you didn't put a brown shot. Yeah. I ask you questions. I know. Yeah, but yeah, and I answer it truthfully. Yeah. Okay. I'm not in your face. You came over here. I waited for my bus. Well, so am I. Bullshit. You're a fake. Then you tell me what damn bus. Look, he's coming up on me again. Right over there. No, you tell me what damn bus I'm waiting on. Let's go in the shade. No, I'm not going to run from him. Ain't nobody running. Let's I'm sending. I'm sending my ground. If I had to, I'll call the cops and have him be arrested for pretending he's a government official when he's not. So That's, you, you tell me what bus I'm waiting on. I don't have to answer your questions, do I? Yeah. No. Yeah, I don't. But, 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 but can you call me liar saying I'm not waiting? You are liar. Where's? Smoking a cigarette. Oh. Hey, did that feel good? If you tell me what bus I'm waiting on. Smoking a cigarette? So here, here's the thing. I asked him questions about his military services. Okay, check this out. You were, you you went in boot camp, right? Okay. Is there any Marines ROTC in Las Vegas? Well he said Los Angeles. What Los Angeles? There's not I don't believe that's more of like a celebrity club. Exactly. There's not one. Is there any way, shape, or form that um walk of shame, y'all, walk of shame. That's right, Lord. <laughs>
I'm National Guard, Sergeant. <laughs> Dude, I could not believe that. Hey, no, no, I, thank you for taking those off. I, I'm just saying, thank you for taking those off. That was the position that was off. What do you mean? I'm just glad that you finally are telling the truth. What job? But you're not you're not telling people you're. A, a, oh wait, you still have the sealed chiden on. Why do you say? Why do you still have the sealed chiden on? You know fucking seal. You're a fucking poser, bro. Are you gonna assault me? What are you gonna do? I, no, this is a public fucking place. I'll do whatever I want. I'm I'm saying. For what? Get out of my face. No. Please, sir. If you don't mind, would you please? No, I'm in a public. I'm in a public place. I'm in a public place. You're still wearing that seal china, I see. And you got a tattoo of it, too? That's pretty funny. Why would you get that? Sir. Back off! Sir. Back off. Before I arrest you. Before arrest I arrest me. You. Arrest me. Right. Back off. You can't arrest me. You couldn't, you couldn't fucking I'll lock you up quicker than you fucking do sticks at me. Hey, see this guy right here? Yeah. Is that, a, is that a threat? Yeah. I can't believe you got a seal fucking trident on your neck. I didn't even see that. You're such a poser. You're a poser. You're a poser. You're a fake. I can't believe you got that on your neck. You're such a phony. Oh, really? I'm getting hit? Yeah. You're such a fucking fraud. Got your hand out for veterans' benefits that you don't even deserve. You think I'm after veterans' benefits, sir? You're, you got your hand out, headline. Why would you wear all that crap? I was after a job, and I got it. Yeah. For what? Stealing it from real real service members who There's need it. Real veterans. Care. You never served a day in your life. Ever. <laughs> That's bullshit. You never served a day in your life. I'm not allowed to say. Right, right. CIA shit, right? You're such a fucking phony. You should take that seal china off. You don't deserve it. That's different. You don't deserve it. That's different. What's different? That's different. Yeah, what's different? Not. How? You didn't, you didn't serve one day in your life. It's not a classified school. It's not a classified school to go through the skills. It's not. It's public record. Give me your last name and your class number. I'll look it up and I'll stop. I'll leave you alone. Can you look it up right now? No, I have to go to my computer. What class number did you graduate from? Right, yeah. What class? How can you remember? It's only three, three numbers. Zero, zero. <laughs> okay, let's see. What year? What month of year did you graduate? Uh, February 92. Okay, zero, three, zero. 131 graduated in 1978. And you're zero, 030? Zero, zero. Zero, zero. 90, 90, write this down. 91? You're out of your layoff. Zero, 030. Zero. Write it down. I don't need to write it down. What do you mean? The what the hell does that mean? No, there's only one seal training. No, there is not. Yes, there is. is it class 030? No, sir, there's not. Class 030, huh? Yeah. What year and month did that graduate? 1992, February. No. Yes, wrong. Yes, class 13 runners in 1997. I enlisted in 1997. Where'd you do seal training? RTC Great Lakes. No, that's, that's wrong. Sir, you're wrong. Please stop. You're wrong. Sir, you You're such know. a fake. Look You're a fake. The whole world's going to know. The whole world's going to know You're a fucking fake. I don't need to look it up. Oh, yeah, I'll thank you. Who are you talking to? Your imaginary friend? No, the police. Good. Now you're a cop. Now you're a cop, huh? I've been a cop for 20 years. Sure you have. Sure. 
Yep, I sure have. You're a phony. You're a fake. Why are you disrespecting me? Because you're a fake. You're a phony. You're pretending to be something that you're not. You're not yeah, you are. Why do you have a seal like fucking tattoo on your neck? You can't tell. Back off. Don't come near me. Put me in jail, motherfucker. I served my country. You didn't. You didn't serve one day in your life. You probably got kicked out all the time for days. For being a fucking weirdo. None of your fucking business. Yeah. Well, shouldn't you know that by now, Mr. CIA? Actually, I do, Donald. <laughs> yeah, Donald Duck. Yeah, yeah. That's it. And is it? Call your people. Yeah, call your people, man. You don't know shit. Oh, yeah? Name one thing. You were born on the fucking moon, man. You are fucking posing. Class 030 in 1992? I don't think so. Try again. What else you got? What's facility training? What? For SEALs? Just for you? They built it just for you? No, it's active. For SEALs? Okay, what's a dragger? That's foreign policy shit. What's a dragger? That's both. That's foreign policy. That's what do you mean foreign policy? That's foreign policy. That's it's a dive rig. That's you guys. SEALs, what SEALs stand for? That's you guys. What does SEALs stand for? Sir, that's your foreign policy people. What's foreign policy mean? You bring Afghanistan. You're in the United States of a fucking America, man. That's where we're at. I didn't leave the country. Where'd you do your training? But you should know what a dragger is. A dragger's a dive rig. <coughs> What's a cell block? A cell block you're going to find out tonight. Mr. Special Police. I can't believe you got a seal tried at tattoo. You got a tattoo on your fucking neck. You're going to make the internet. I can't believe you got a seal. the last time you had a shower? Oh, man, I'm going to tell you it's been a long time. Has it really? Yeah. You want to have one tonight? The whole world's gonna come crashing down on you. Fatigues. I understand you're in fatigues, but you are not authorized to wear that uniform if you were in the Navy. That is not a Navy uniform. Oh, I just, bro, like Navy SEALs wear these. Navy SEALs do not wear those. I know that from experience because I was an active duty soldier for six years with the 82nd Airborne Division, like I just explained to you. So I would, get, I would really appreciate it if you got up and took that uniform off right now, the bro, top. Bro, like uh, as a Navy SEAL, I just like... Uh, uh, you're a Navy SEAL. Are you telling me you're a Navy SEAL? Yeah, bro. Okay, so what team? Well, just like... Uh, like, like, like uh, That's like, a simple uh, question. What team? Like, like SEAL, SEAL team. Uh, it's like SEAL, SEAL team or... Uh, SEAL, SEAL, SEAL Team 6? So you were in SEAL Team 6? Okay, so uh, what year? Oh, it's like 90s, 90s. 90s, you were in SEAL Team 6. So how come you're in an Army uniform? Oh, bro, I mean, like, I just, like, I mean, So why are you not in a Navy uniform? Oh, I just, like, this is like uh, Navy SEALs. So, like, that's why I that's the Navy like, SEALs, okay, so how come you're in yeah, Go yeah. Fasters right here? Well, I just need to be out the door, bro. Like, um, I don't you need to be out the door, how come? I'm, I'm just asking you questions about... You know what stolen valor is on the internet, right? No, 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 no. It's completely illegal. I can turn you into the the uh, the uh, I can turn you into the police right now and have you arrested for that. Oh, bro, I, I, I don't mean to, like steal valor, but but I was. Yeah, yeah but you're wearing a uniform. You're wearing a uniform. I watched my friends dying overseas. Well, bro, bro, so bro, for bro, respect bro. for that, would you stand up and take that top off? Bro, Navy SEALs, we wear we wear these like. Uh, Navy SEALs wear those. I've got friends that are Navy SEALs. Navy SEALs do not wear those. So for respect for me and my service and my friends that are in the psychiatric ICU right now that have watched their friends die in front of them and bled in that uniform, would you, out of respect for me, take the top off right now? Bro, it's not like I, I mean, I, I, don't, I don't have like, uh, like 20 you uniforms. Got a shirt like, on, you got a shirt on underneath, right? I don't have 20 uniforms like I used to have. Like, like, like I used to have 20 uniforms. I only have like this. What was your rank? Uh, 
Enlistment uh, semen apprentice for like semen. You're a semen apprentice. Yeah. Okay. Stolen Valor. Stolen Valor. YouTube. Right here. Stolen Valor. Hey, you in the army? Yeah. Come here for a second. What unit are you with? I haven't been deployed yet. I just got back from basic and shit. So. What are you doing walking around in your camis, man? You know you're not supposed to do that. Why are you wearing a Marine Corps shirt if you're in the Army? Random ass shirt to wear. What's that? Random ass shirt to wear. So why are you walking around without a cami blouse on, man? Do you want to wear right now, sir? Let me see your cat card. Why are you videotaping? Let me see your cat card. I got it. Where is it? Oh, sir. Do you know that you're not supposed to go anywhere, especially in a uniform, yes, know, without having your cat card with you? Yes, You've seen a cat card? Yes, sir. You have a cat card. What's the back of the cat card say? What's the purpose of the cat card? Prove that I'm a, my man. That's not what the purpose of the cat card is. The purpose of the cat card is the Geneva Convention. It gives you your rights if you're ever captured in a foreign area. It tells you what your rights are. Again, why are you wearing this? Where'd you get it? Your, your, your laces are on blouse, dude? Come on, man. You're not in the military, are you? You're not? What are you doing wearing this stuff? You're going to do it, but you're wearing a Marine Corps shirt with an army camouflage, man. You can't be doing this. My friends died wearing this shit, man. I take a lot of disrespect to it. So this is your brother's stuff? Pants are. I don't got gloves. What's your, what's your brother's last name? Woodard, sir. Let me see the back of the pants. I'm not sure if it's hard. You're not even wearing the right belt. Come on, man. You need to go home and take this shit off. For real. You don't need to be telling people you are. You want to do it, go join. I'm all for it if you want to join, but you can't be walking around, man. You're, you're disrespecting what all of us stand for, okay? Yes, all right, go home and change and take this stuff off. Don't be need telling people you're in the military, all right? Mm -hmm. You're not even shaving, dude. Mm -hmm. Come on, you got the haircut that's out of regs. Army's lax, but they ain't that lax. Mm -hmm. You know better than that, man. Don't dishonor your brother. Mm -hmm. Your brother, what would your brother say if he was here right now? Probably Why? Because Why? Because he served me. Because you didn't earn it? Because you didn't go through boot camp? Yeah. Because you didn't earn the right to wear any of this shit? You're wearing Marine Corps. You have to, I take that personally because I was in the Marine Corps. You know what I had to do to get that? You know how long it took me to get the little eagle globe and anchor pinned on my hat? And you're going to walk around the t-shirt with the wrong fucking cami pants and the wrong fucking boots. You got Air Force boots, Army pants, Marine Corps shirt, and a soft cover when you're not even wearing a blouse. That to me says that you're carrying a firearm if you're wearing a t-shirt with a cover on. That's a dangerous thing to do if a cop's in the military sees you walking around like that. You know that? Yes, so go home. Where you live close to here? A little bit far from there. Go walk straight fucking home. Don't talk to anybody. If someone wants to talk to you, say, I'm, I'm, I can't right now. Go straight home, take that shit off, and don't ever fucking wear it again. Okay. All right? Okay. He ain't in the fucking army. That's why I'm doing this, okay? I take this personally. My friends die wearing this shit. You know, people do this shit so they get free stuff. They think they look cool. They think they act cool. That ain't cool. I was in the Marine Corps. I got the tattoos. That's why. I don't want you to think I'm yelling at him, picking on him. This is that's why. It's okay. There's. It's called stolen valor. People go around doing this shit. They say, "Oh, I served over here, served here with this, did this, did that for this country." And they didn't do shit. You know, so that's why I'm yelling at him. I don't mean to, you know, disres I don't disrespect service members. I was in the Marine Corps for four years, served my country proudly. I'm proud of it. But you can't be doing this shit. This is a slap in my face for what I did. So go home, take that shit off, man. I'm serious. Go. break right yeah i'm on lunch dude hey this is the guy i was telling you about he was all this guy's also in the army bro oh you know the military he's a servant uh, i was 11 12 what were you stationed at uh i was in iraq since 2011 though i'm back now you were in iraq for five years mm -hmm. that's some shit dude uh, what unit i don't like talking about it Come he on, was man. also what? He was a sniper for fucking 11 Bravo. He, he wasn't a ranger. That's what's up. I gotta go. You gotta bounce? Yeah. Are you on lunch? Come chill. Yeah. I'm gonna chill. I, oh yeah. I got so much stuff on my mind. I was thinking about doing it, but I know you gotta fill out like an ID10T form. That didn't take you long to film, right? It's just 11 Bravo. You don't start off with rangers. You fill that ID10T form? You fill that IDT temp form? 
How long is it going to take? You look like the type of guy to lose keys to the Humvee. What was your unit's protocol for losing keys to the Humvee? And as always, make sure you're your local Gilbert. Nobody's lost keys? That's a fucking Ranger unit right there. Nobody losing keys to the Humvee. Not anybody I knew, anyways. But, you know, it could, it could happen. You always got that one dickhead. You always got that one dickhead. You always got that one dickhead. Sometimes. You're a Ranger Bat? You're a Bat Baby? Mm -hmm. What? You got Savannah, Joint Base Lewis McCord? Where were you at? Hmm? Where you got Joint Base Lewis McCord or Savannah? McCord, yeah. So you were third back then? Mm hmm. Okay. Where's Jesse then? Peter. Uh, Jesse and Aaron. Kendra. I don't know if they're there. <laughs> that fool's daughter fucking leave. Where do you? You know what? I'm mad at you though. What? We don't have the dream team no more. We don't have no. We don't have two meatheads. No, we don't. Hey, Skylar, do you know what stolen valor is? Where? You know what stolen valor is? You know what you're doing is wrong, right? You just lied to us about being a ranger. You understand that's a felony? Did you lie to Daniela for this job? No. You know that's a federal offense, right? No, I didn't. Why I want you to apologize because you told everybody here that you were an army ranger. You weren't, and we just verified. That's wrong. I'm giving you the opportunity to apologize, and maybe I won't report it. Are you sorry? Yeah. You're in the camera. I had a buddy that died in Afghanistan. I've had friends that fucking died in Afghanistan, bro. You know what that means to me? I had a friend recently die in Afghanistan, and you're making the fucking military look bad. He was the second American killed by ISIS. You plan on going in? Obama had a half mass for him. His name is Staff Sergeant Louis S. Cardin, and you told me a while back that you knew him, but you fucking didn't. Are you planning okay. on going in? That's bullshit, because bro. everything you said is a lie. I can tell you that now. Or do you plan on going in the military? Do you plan on going in the military? Who's your recruiter? Just... Who's your recruiter? No one yet. No one yet. So you're not even going in yet. Let me tell you something, man. I've done things that I still have nightmares about from 19 to 25. And for you to lie about it is not cool, man. All right? I gave you every opportunity. I asked you, what range about you in? You said third. Third station at Fort Benning, Georgia. You said you're in Iraq for five years? That's impossible. What you did is a felony offense, dude. Especially if you got discounts claiming that you were in the military? And what you're doing, like the stories I hear, what you're doing out here, saying you got PTSD and stuff, you're making me look bad because I got PTSD and I don't do that. So if you want to shit on my branch, you better make sure I don't hear about it. That's not cool, man. At all. You understand me? Yeah. And you've been making us all look bad. Now, I never confronted you about it Lying because about you me. told me you told me that you got kicked out, and I don't want to hurt your feelings. I don't want to be like confronting you and asking you, hey, were you really in the military after you told me that your buddy got kicked out, right? You want to go outside and do that? No, no, that's fine. We dealt with it. You're on camera and you're done lying. You understand me? That's stolen valor. Fuck out of my face. What's up? No, I'm fine. Is the pager working? Yeah, why? Oh, oh. Attention, Goodwill workers and staff. We have a case of stolen valor. Skylar Powell is not a military. Luke, I can't have you do that. I'm sorry. I'm good. 